So last week we interviewed uh, several amounts of people talking about AI, um, their knowledge, the latest trends and their concerns about the new technology. So there are like three important topics to discuss about them. So the first concern is if artificial intelligence will take my job. So there are a few things to remind here. The first one is that artificial intelligence is likely to replace some automatic task that some jobs uh, carry on. So it will replace how you do things, but it's not likely to take your job. In some cases it will, but it's not the, like the general case. Um, I wouldn't worry about that. In the other hand, we need to consider also that artificial intelligence will come progressively. It will be progressive and also we need to bear in mind that artificial intelligence will bring new opportunities or new job opportunities in this case. So that's the, um, what I have to say in the first concern. So the second concern was if we are not capable of adapting ourselves to the latest trends or the speed uh, of artificial intelligence, the speed of development actually. So what can I say in this matter? Um, it's actually otherwise. The speed of development is determined by our capacity of adapting to the new trends. An example of this are autonomous cars. Um, autonomous cars development has been around for several years and you cannot see yet autonomous cars as a trend in uh, car brands. There's only one or two that are applying it in several, certain regions, but it's not that massive. That's because we still need to develop it. We are not yet capable of adapting to that. This third concern was about our data and a little bit of our privacy. What happens with my information or everything I input to an artificial intelligence? Is it stored? Can be reused somehow? So let's highlight three things here. First thing to highlight is that in Europe and the rest of the world as well, there's a lot of legislation on data privacy. So in a way, we can be sure that companies have to protect our personal information. So the second one is that some models of artificial intelligence that need our information or our inputs to be retrained or to reinforce learning stores the information in a way that can only be used by the same model of artificial intelligence, which means that we cannot output this information or extract it to something else. And the third thing to highlight is that most of artificial intelligence models that require our information, they are used to encryption. So we, uh, most of our data is encrypted inside the model. So there's no way that someone else can understand what we say to the artificial intelligence. So I wouldn't worry much about this. <laughs>